Singapore, a city-state smaller than New York City, yet punching far above its weight on the global stage. While other nations dream, Singapore builds the impossible. In 2025, this island nation is executing not one, not two, but five mega projects that redefine what's achievable in modern construction. We're talking about structures that defy physics and expansions that dwarf their legendary predecessors. From a super tall skyscraper that vanishes into the clouds to a floating stage larger than a football field cantilevered over water, these projects are reshaping the skyline of one of the world's most ambitious cities. The combined price tag? Over $20 billion. The combined audacity? Immeasurable. What you're about to witness are five mega projects that prove Singapore isn't just building for today, it's engineering tomorrow. And when you reach number one, you'll see a $6.8 billion attempt to transform a casino island into a zero-waste paradise, a sustainable utopia on a scale never attempted before. Let's count down the five Singapore mega projects transforming the Lion City in 2025. Number five. Skywaters Residences, Singapore's tallest tower, 305 meters, 1,001 feet of engineered audacity piercing the clouds above Singapore's central business district. This is Skywaters Residences, and it's redefining what's possible in one of the world's most vertically ambitious cities. From the ground, this needle-thin supertall vanishes into the sky like a real-life Blade Runner tower. 63 stories clad in engineered bamboo facades that shimmer in tropical sunlight, weaving natural materials into a structure that shouldn't exist at this altitude. Sky gardens cascade down every 10 floors, adding 10,000 square meters of verdant terraces that transform the tower into a vertical jungle suspended above the city. The crown glows at night, a lantern-like pinnacle with AI-controlled lighting that shifts with weather patterns visible across the island. At the summit, a rooftop infinity pool hovers over the CBD, offering helicopter pad level views where one million daily commuters converge below at the intersection of the CBD Marina Bay and the greater southern waterfront. Here's the engineering marvel. Building a super tall in Singapore's dense urban core means battling typhoon winds and soil liquefaction that would topple conventional towers. The solution? A megacore foundation system that locks the structure like a bamboo stalk bending in monsoon gales, distributing forces through 148,000 square meters of precisely calculated floor area. 190 ultra-luxury residences sit atop Alibaba's global headquarters. $4.5 billion invested to crown Singapore as Asia's ultimate vertical metropolis. This tower is so tall, you could stack Singapore's 100 Shenton Way twice and still fall short. You could fit the entire original Marina Bay Sands Sky Park inside its height with room left for a helicopter pad on top. This is Singapore's vertical frontier made real. The tallest statement a city-state can make, soaring above everything that came before. Number 4. NS Square, Southeast Asia's largest cantilevered grandstand. Imagine a stage so massive it floats like a black mirror over Marina Bay, reflecting Singapore's glittering skyline back at itself. Now imagine that stage cantilevering 25 meters over water. That's longer than a blue whale's body suspended over the reservoir with nothing but engineering audacity holding it up. This is NS Square, a $500 million monument to national pride, rising where the old float Marina Bay once stood. A 30,000-seat grandstand built to honor Singapore's 1 million national servicemen and host spectacles visible from half the island. The engineering challenge? Stabilizing a colossal structure over water while ships navigate beneath and tidal surges pound the foundation. Traditional methods fail here. Instead, engineers deployed innovative vibro compaction and basement pilings driven deep into the reservoir bed, anchoring the platform against seismic tremors and typhoon force winds without disrupting maritime traffic. The platform itself spans 120 meters by 83 meters. 10,000 tons of recycled concrete and steel from the demolished float, reborn as a permanent powerhouse stage. Robotics and AI-powered tools guided every bolt and beam into position with millimeter precision, 
At night, the cantilever ignites with red LED accents, transforming the bay into a floating red carpet leading into the city. When National Day fireworks erupt, this stage becomes the frame, turning explosions into orchestrated art over the water. Here's the staggering reality. This structure could theoretically seat every single Singaporean at one National Day Parade, a futuristic coliseum rising from the bay, designed not just for annual spectacles, but as a year-round public haven in the heart of Marina Bay's skyline. This is nation-building made visible, steel, concrete, and pride suspended over water. Number 3. Marina Bay Sands Expansion, 4th Tower, the world's most expensive hotel expansion. $8 billion. Let that sink in. This single tower costs more than the entire original Marina Bay Sands, the iconic triple tower complex that has defined Singapore's skyline since 2010. This is ambition on a scale that defies logic. Rising 55 stories above Marina Bay, the fourth tower is a sleek glass prism rotated 45 degrees from its siblings, glowing like a fourth diamond slotted into the skyline. Its V-shaped base reflects the bay like liquid mercury at golden hour, while its twin-wing design curves over 200 meters wide, anchoring against typhoon winds howling at 200 kilometers per hour. But the real spectacle floats above. A 76,000-square-foot sky roof cantilevered 200 meters over the water, a platform so vast it redefines what's possible at that altitude. 570 all-suite rooms offering panoramic views that turn every window into a postcard. Adjacent to the tower, a 15,000-seat arena pulses with LED-clad curves and light shows visible from Sentosa. This arena alone could host the entire production crew of a global concert tour nightly, a glowing exclamation point on the skyline that transforms Marina Bay into a perpetual stage. 5,000 workers are assembling this colossus in phases, integrating biophilic steel and glass facades wrapped with 20,000 square meters of living greenery. The challenge? Building a standalone giant without eclipsing the iconic three-tower silhouette that millions recognize instantly. The solution? Rotate it 45 degrees for unobstructed bay views while using a V-shaped podium to distribute wind loads and seismic forces. The goal is audacious. Lure 50 million annual visitors with ultra-luxury spectacles that eclipse the original Marina Bay Sands' 470 million guests since opening. This tower doesn't just expand an icon, it overshadows it. The new postcard of Singapore, screaming future city from every angle. Number 2. Harbor Front Center Redevelopment – The Tower That Greeneries the Sea Picture a rusty 1970s ferry terminal being devoured by salt water and time. Now imagine transforming that corroding relic into a 33-story vertical jungle rising from Singapore's industrial waterfront. This is the Harbor Front Center redevelopment, and it's solving a problem most engineers consider impossible. Here's the challenge. Saltwater corrosion at this coastal site eats through steel at 10 times the normal rate. Tidal floods threaten any structure built at sea level. Rising oceans promise to swallow conventional foundations within decades. Yet Singapore is building upward anyway, creating a 13,000-square-meter elevated park that floats above the waves like a green mirage. The solution? A verdant tapestry facade of solar-integrated bamboo and smart hydroponics that transforms seawater into mist-cooled gardens. AI-monitored pilings drive deep into the seabed, lifting the entire park above two-meter storm surges. The result is a structure that doesn't fight the ocean. It dances with it. The numbers tell the story of ambition. This tower spans 123,000 square meters, 47% larger than the concrete fortress it replaces. It withstands winds howling at 150 kilometers per hour and sea level rises of one meter, five times more green space than the original structure. Electric vehicle chargers outnumber parking spots three to one. But here's what makes this project unforgettable. Workers will harvest rooftop herbs while watching container ships vanish over the Straits of Singapore a breathable skyscraper where nature and commerce collide. Science fiction's floating Eden made real on reclaimed land that shouldn't exist. Number 1. Resorts World Sentosa Waterfront Development Asia's greenest waterfront utopia, 
Can a casino island transform into a zero-waste paradise? That's the radical question behind the $6.8 billion reinvention of Resorts World Sentosa. This isn't just an expansion. It's a declaration that luxury and sustainability can coexist on a scale never attempted before. Picture this. An 88-meter glowing mountain sculpture designed by Thomas Heatherwick rising from the waterfront like a bioluminescent beacon. At night, it morphs through colors, beaming like a digital aurora visible across the straits. AI-orchestrated trails wind to its summit, where you overlook a transformed Sentosa that looks less like a theme park and more like a scene from Tron. Below, the experience defies convention. You kayak through LED-lit lagoons where bioluminescent waves ripple beneath your paddle. You dine inside vertical farm towers where solar sail canopies flutter overhead, generating clean energy while you eat herbs harvested meters above your table. You walk through underwater tunnels in an oceanarium tripled in size, now housing over 100,000 sea creatures across more than 1,000 species. This is the rebranded Singapore Oceanarium, positioned as the world's greenest mega-aquarium. 700 luxury suites span two new hotels. Asia's largest immersive minion land sprawls across the grounds. Zero-carbon retail at the Weave Complex redefines shopping as a sustainable act. Solar sails and recycled wave energy power the entire complex, turning every sunset swim into a generator for the city grid. Here's the audacious vision. 30 million tourists annually visiting a resort where every experience contributes to environmental restoration rather than destruction. A climate-vulnerable island pioneering the blueprint for 21st century escapes. This is Sentosa shedding its casino island identity and emerging as the world's first proof that mega resorts can heal rather than harm. The entire waterfront lights up at night, not just with spectacle, but with purpose. A utopia that dares to ask, what if paradise could be sustainable? Five mega projects. Over $20 billion in combined investment. From floating stages cantilevered over water to super tall towers vanishing into clouds, Singapore is building the future right now. So which project impressed you the most? The record-breaking Marina Bay Sands expansion, the sustainable utopia of Resorts World Sentosa, or Singapore's tallest tower piercing 305 meters into the sky? Drop your answer in the comments below. If you enjoyed this countdown of Singapore's most ambitious construction projects, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. We've got more mega projects, engineering marvels, and impossible builds coming your way. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.